Wagwan Full Art Lovers, Full Art J back with another one. And in today's video, we're going to go through some Pokemon items I found at Costco. So Costco's making another appearance again like it did in the summertime. But with these two packs, I think they've had Pokeballs before. But this was before I was collecting it. But it has a tin of Pokeball combination. So you got the OG, the Flareon there. And we got Jolteon here. And last but not least, we got Vaporeon. Vaporeon. So I am from Toronto, so it costs $24.99, which I think it's a good deal. You're getting a tin and a Pokeball. If there's like two packs in the Pokeball and four packs in the tin, you know, it's pretty worth it, depending on what packs are in there. But yeah, $24.99 is not a bad deal. For the five Kanto pack that I did in the summertime in that vid, I think they were like, I paid like, it was supposed to be on sale for like $38, but I think I paid like $36, $35. So it was, you know, even less. But I think the original price was almost like 50 bucks. So if these go on sale, man, you're gonna, they're going to fly. Um, let's get down into it. I'm not going to open all of them. I bought these, you know, to save for my collection. Bought an extra Flareon one to open up. So let's get down into it and let's see what we get. All right. You know it's fresh mat time, bruh. Fresh mat alert. If you guys follow me on IG at FullRJ, you would have seen that I posted this pic. I feel bad, yo, because like if I zoom in or if I zoom out too far, you guys won't be able to see the cards. It gets too blurry. So until I get a proper camera, I'm just gonna adjust it real quick. So we got the man Charmander. So if y'all don't know, this is Pokemon meets Mortal Kombat. But real talk though, I don't know who Charmander is. <laughs> I don't know who he's supposed to be. I don't know if he's supposed to be like Air Mac or who. I don't know who his character is supposed to be. But then you already know Bulbasaur would be Reptile. Squirtle's going to be Sub-Zero. And then Pikachu is... Whew. If y'all didn't know Pikachu is my favorite Pokemon, now you know. Pikachu is Scorpion, fam. Man, looks greasy. Look at that. Get over here. Get over here. And it's RGB, fam. Yo. Amazon, dog. I couldn't even find this on, like, AliExpress. That's where I get most of my mats from. You can even, like, customize mats, too, on AliExpress if you find the right seller. But I'm, I'm going to have to cut off Charmander because, you know, Pikachu is my favorite. Can't go too far. But anyways, let's get down into this. So we already know we got one of the Pokeballs. So one of the, remember I was saying before, like, see something was on the bottom. I like you would know, like, before I'd be like, okay, yeah, C, whatever, C20 or I don't know, remember the number, but it had like X, Y in it, whatever. So we'll find out what's in here. And then this Flareon tin with the GX promo. I'm loving this tin still because you got the Vaporeon, got Jolteon, and you also got Flareon there. And it says Pokemon TCG. And you have the flare on unless you know what. No, it's, it's a pretty cool tin, man. They're good, like, decorative pieces if, you know, put them up somewhere. You can even, like, nail them to the wall. Things like that if you have enough of them. It would be a pretty dope wall. All right, so we'll save the tin for last. We'll get into the Pokeball. So, I don't remember. I think I saw a lot of videos where there, there were three packs in it. Or two packs. So, we'll see how much is in here. And it also comes with a coin because... I can hear the coin inside, so. Oh, it comes with three packs. Even better. I think this is Raikou. Raikou coin. It's the same man right here. It's the same dude. Sorry. Look at that. Pretty cool. Uh, there was no code in this. Pokeballs are pretty cool too. You could probably like nail this to the wall or something too and make a little display. So we have Sword and Shield based. It's pretty crumpled up. Hopefully the cards aren't like, you know, bent up. But we got Sword and Shield based. We got Rebel Clash. And we have a Darkness Ablaze, so there's a chance for a Zard in here. Maybe the Pokeballs now that are coming out, the newer ones, they might have like this generation. 
because this generation is up it's almost up because once that that new game comes out uh you know we'll have a new generation of pokemon cards so we'll open up the tin this beautiful tin oh i love these tins bro so we get the nice Flareon. It's a good shine on there. Promo card. Oh, I think there's... Oh, I thought there was two cards there for a second. I think one might be... Yes. Promo code. Get your codes. So we'll focus. I have more codes for y'all. I don't know if these codes are good or not, but... You know, you guys can have them. I don't remember where I opened them from, so. Let me know if you get anything good from these. And hopefully we get some better luck on the pulls this week. Or this vid, because last vid was... Yo, that was that was murderous still. My luck was horrible. Sleeve up this Flareon right quick. Nice Flareon there. Here we go. This is garbage. So we do have four packs right here. And there's nothing else in the tin, it's just the cardboard. So we got Battle Styles here, we got a Vivid Voltage, we also have a Darkness Ablaze, I think it's two Darkness Ablaze, and another Rebel Clash. So it's not bad, Darkness Ablaze, you can get the Rainbow Chew, which is mad money, you can get the Zard. This is my favorite set, y'all might think I'm crazy, but this was a set at the time uh, when I started collecting again. This was a set that was the relevant set that was out. So this is the set that got me back into it. So Battle Styles will always have a place in my heart. And I'm trying to do the master set for it. So we got Rebel Clash. And we got one Sword and Shield, one Vivid Voltage. So I'm going to leave. Well, I'm going to do Battle Styles first because you already know how it is. Or I'll do Rebel Clash, Base. Something like that. Something like that. Or do like that. Hopefully we get something good, because when we opened up that Canto tin one, yo, from Costco, it was not too good. Sorry, we got Rhyhorn, Blipbug, Pinchurchin, Pinchurchin, Sobble, we got a Wulu, and we got a Reverse Hollow Chinchu, Chinchao. And we got a John Morant, a.k.a. Crown Morant. We got a Salazzle, B-Sharp, Energy Switch. The first code here. You know we got to start it off with the fire, the bangers. I don't, even, I don't even collect these sets. Like, I'm like battle styles and up. Like I said, that's when I started collecting. So I don't even like... Like, not even Vivid Voltage, anything like that. I don't buy those. I have some cards, though. But, not into Master Setting, you know. I had Electabuzz. Magmar. We got a Skullvit. Snover. We got a Natu. Reverse Hollow Glamarian. Glamarian, holy. <laughs> Galarian Darmanaka. Darumaka. Darumaka. Oh, we got a first hit. We got a Grim Snarl. Hollow. Not too bad, not too bad. Electro. We'll look at all the other cards. Zot 2. We got the Ombre Lombre. And we got your code card. Jeez. Cameron never want to work with me, bruh. Always working against me. Oh, 
One hit so far is not... Eee, I'm betting the cards. Not bad. I'll do a card trick for this one. I'm going to open a booster box. I won't do card tricks. But for these ones... Four. We'll do card tricks. So we got Fighting Energy. We got Metapod. Yo, that Metapod is janky. Look at it. It's like someone's grandma knitted it. Yo. We got a Heliosk. Got a Burning Scarf. We got a Temple. Galerian Corsola. I've never seen this before. Valiabi. Valiabi. We got a Toxel. And is this? No. We got Mr. Mime, the Galarian Edition. We got Carcoal. Ooh, and we got a Dragapult V Max. Okay, I'll take it. It's a hit. No, it's a hit. It's a hit. But that's a nice hit. Dragapult V Max. Got the fire pulls from the fire tin. Pretty nice. There's tons of Dragapult cards out there. Promos and whatnot, you know, so. Wasn't bad. Good hit, good hit. Now on to my boy Battle uh Battle Styles. Hopefully we can get, you know, something good. I'll give you the code. I'm trying to do it in a way so you don't, don't see the you know. <laughs> I have all the reverse hollows, so don't need any reverse hollows. Two of them are Golbat. We got a Glissor. Onyx. Cherubi. Parishu. Chimeco. Chimeco. Honedge. Got a reverse hollow Cheryl. And a Marowak. On to the vivid. We got the code here for everybody. My code hunters, let me know what y'all get. Leave a comment. The giveaway is still going on. We're at 47 subscribers, I think 48 right now. So when we hit that 200 mark, we'll do the draw. So all you got to do is like and comment. Like and comment on any video. It doesn't have to be that particular one. Any video is fine. And I'll let everybody enter into the draw to win that three-pack blister with the Suicune pin. Got pick a peck Choodle. Riolu, Chimeco, Chimichu on my feet. Don't know what that is. We got a Sandile Reverse Hollow. And we got a Toucan Salmon. Toucan and Salmon. Alright, on to Darkness. I messed that up completely. Bro, this pack, <laughs> the hit was flipped. I had to flip it over. We got Rose Tower, Familiar Bell, Arena, Aridos, Ariados. We got Ducklet, we got Clink. We got Grimer, we got Wimpod, Fletchling, well, Wigglytuff is a reverse hollow, pretty cool, and a Volcarona. Alright, 
All right, we got LPMs going up in here. I'm gonna do this regular. I don't wanna spoil the surprise. We already know it's Full RJ. Full RJ when he pulls green cards. <laughs> we got Teddy Ursa. And we got Panpour. We got Shelmet. The Smelt with a helmet. <laughs> Scovit. Oops. Diglett. By Diglett. We got Trapich. And a Golethi. That was our hit. We got a Combustion. Poltergeist. And your code. So not bad. We got, well, I think two hits. We did get a VMAX. So I think it was a lot better than what we were pulling from those Kanto packs that we got from Costco before. So once again, y'all, that's the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Remember, y'all, check out your local Costco. If you're in Canada or you're in the States, you will find these products. I don't think they're, you know, flying off the shelf like the Kanto ones were because there was a ton of stock. But I do think for Canada, at least in my area, they restock on Fridays. So like and subscribe as always. And until next time, peace.